quite a few supers to get it worthy to fight you, but man, it wasn't good enough! After you trashed the last one, I had to make some major modifications. Sure, it was difficult, but you are worth it. I mean, after all, I am your biggest fan. Buddy? My name is not Buddy! <clears throat> and it's not Incrediboy either! That ship has sailed! All I wanted was to help you. I only wanted to help! And what did you say to me? Fly home, buddy. I work alone. It tore me apart. But I learned an important lesson. You can't count on anyone, especially your heroes. I was wrong to treat you that way. I'm sorry. See? Now you respect me, because I'm a th- Okay, here's a review. This. About the movie, The Incredibles. This is about... Buddy, Incredible Boy, or Syndrome, whatever you want, whatever you guys want to call him, and Mr. Incredible or Bob. So you know the scene when, when Mr. Incredible tells Buddy that he works alone. Fly home, Buddy. I work alone. Yeah, that really hurts Syndrome so badly or Incredible Boy so badly, and then made him decide to re get revenge on him. But the funniest thing is, no, that wasn't funny, but that's how he's funny, but he literally says he's a threat, even because of Mr. Incredibles. But he, what Buddy was trying to do, he was just trying to kill his own, he was trying to kill Mr. Incredibles' family, and, and he also killed real heroes. Like, why would you want to do that? It's not their fault. I mean... I kind of feel bad for Buddy, but not at the same exact time. But I will say one thing about him. You might think it's Mr. Incredible's bad, but that was actually his own bad. He chose to obsess him too much and sneak in his car, so it's his own fault. Here's what he could have done instead if he didn't kill real heroes. He could have just funded another superhero. And this would have never happened to him if he didn't kill any, try to kill any heroes. And there's another thing. Sometimes we can't always have what we want. Life isn't fair. It's sick. And I actually had the same exact problem with Buddy. Except I had a crush on somebody. I obsessed her too much. And the day I had a I was at lunch near my cafeteria, right? I'm in special needs, by the way. And I and I was a fifth grader and um I was in half classes. Some kid, so my lunch table was full of kids and there was nowhere for me to sit. So I decided to sit with her class. And I sat by her. Guess what? She literally yelled at me and started being aggressive to me. And that hurt me a lot. So yeah. So we all have problems like this. Just wanted to be in a relationship with her, but she felt different. Like, again... Sometimes we gotta accept how things are. Don't wind up like Buddy. Do not wind up like anybody that does wrong. Thanks for watching this video. See you next time. Goodbye.